It is easy for him to talk about the destroyed harbor. Aristotle isn't interested in ships except when he goes on pleasure cruises. But I could do without yet another obstacle to consume my trade revenues, as if those bandits weren't enough already. You see, as soon as those monsters started retreating, all manner of filthy brigands emerged from their hiding places again, exploiting the chaos the creatures left behind to claim new places for themselves on the roads and passes. One particularly annoying group that follows an outlaw called Skyron has established their domain on some rocks on the Saronic coast, overlooking the road to Kenkriai. They hide or entrench themselves when seeing a contingent of soldiers, but are more than happy to come down and ambush trade carts and lone travelers. This is where you could be helpful, Monster Slayer. If you go that way, they may not expect much resistance from a single warrior because they don't know who you are. It is dangerous, certainly, but if you manage to lure their leader out and dispatch him, I would make it worth your while.
Skyron is dead? Finally! And they even had centaurs! That is, I mean, I never doubted you. I expect the rest of the vermin will scatter without a leader, which means that at least one harbor will be accessible now. Very good. Here is your reward, as promised.